Have you ever wondered how to secure your financial future? How about building a steady stream of income that grows over time? Welcome to the world of dividend investing. Let's start at the beginning. What exactly is dividend investing? Well, in the most basic terms, it's an investment strategy that focuses on buying shares in companies that pay out dividends. But what are dividends? Imagine you own a piece of a company, a slice of the pie if you will. As the company makes money, it slices up a portion of its earnings and distributes them to shareholders like you. These portions are dividends. Now not all companies do this. Some prefer to reinvest all their profits back into the business, for growth or to pay off debt. But others, particularly those that are well-established and generate consistent profits, often share a piece of their success with their shareholders through dividends. This is where dividend investing comes into play. It's all about picking those companies that not only pay dividends, but have a track record of consistently increasing them over time. The goal? To build a portfolio that provides a steady, growing income stream. Think of it as a snowball effect. You start small, perhaps with a few shares in a dividend-paying company. As dividends are paid out, you reinvest them by buying more shares. Over time, you own more shares, which means more dividends, which allows you to buy even more shares, and so on. It's a cycle that, given time and patience, can lead to a significant source of income. The real beauty of dividend investing lies in its potential to contribute to financial independence. Imagine having an income that doesn't rely on you working a 9-to-5 job. Instead, your money is working for you, generating income while you sleep, play or explore new passions. Now that you have a basic understanding of what dividend investing is, let's delve deeper into the process. Diving into dividend investing might seem daunting at first, but with a few key steps, you can start your journey towards financial freedom. So, let's break down the process of dividend investing. The first step is research. This isn't your run-of-the-mill Google search. It's about delving deep into the financial world, exploring potential companies you might want to invest in. This could be industry giants or under-the-radar firms that have a promising future. You're looking for companies that have a history of stable earnings and are likely to continue doing well. Once you've got a list of potential companies, the next step is to evaluate their dividend yield and payout ratio. The dividend yield is the annual dividend payment divided by the stock's current market price. It essentially tells you what return you can expect from the dividend alone. On the other hand, the payout ratio, which is the proportion of earnings a company pays to its shareholders in dividends, helps you gauge if the company's dividends are sustainable in the long run. A lower payout ratio could mean the company has room to increase its dividends in the future. Now that you've done your research and crunched the numbers, it's time for the final step, making the investment. This is where you buy shares in the companies you've identified. But remember, don't put all your eggs in one basket. Diversification is key. By spreading your investments across various companies and sectors, you can mitigate risk and increase the potential for returns. But don't just diversify for the sake of it. Be strategic. Consider factors like the company's industry, the stability of its earnings, its financial health, and its future growth prospects. A well-diversified portfolio is like a well-balanced meal. It gives you the right mix of nutrients to keep you financially healthy. Remember, the key to successful dividend investing lies in thorough research and strategic diversification. So embark on this journey with a clear plan and a keen eye for detail, and you could unlock a world of financial freedom. Why should you consider dividend investing? Aside from the potential for financial independence, there are several other benefits. Let's take a deep dive into these benefits to better understand why dividend investing is a strategy that could transform your portfolio. First off, Dividend investing provides a consistent income stream. When you invest in a company that pays dividends, you'll receive a portion of their profits on a regular basis, usually quarterly. This is an excellent way to generate a steady flow of income, independent of market fluctuations. Imagine this as your personal money river, continuously flowing into your bank account, irrespective of how the stock market is performing. Next, let's talk about capital appreciation. As the company you've invested in grows over time, so does the value of your shares. This means that not only do you receive dividends, but you also stand to gain from the increase in the company's stock price. It's like planting a tree. And while you enjoy the fruits it bears, the tree itself is growing taller and stronger. Now let's discuss the power of compounding through dividend reinvestment. 
This is where the magic really happens. When you reinvest your dividends by buying more shares, you increase the amount of dividends you receive in the future. Think of it as a snowball effect. You start off with a small snowball at the top of the hill, and as it rolls down, it collects more snow and grows larger. This is the same principle that applies to dividend reinvestment. The more you reinvest, the more your wealth snowballs over time. As you can see, dividend investing offers a multitude of benefits that can help secure your financial future. It's a strategy that allows you to generate a consistent income, benefit from capital appreciation, and leverage the power of compounding. This is a path toward financial freedom that is worth considering, and with the right approach and persistence, you too can unlock the power of dividend investing. Still skeptical about the power of dividend investing? Let's take a look at some success stories. First, let's talk about Grace Groner. Back in the 1930s, she bought three shares of Abbott Laboratories for a total of $180. She held onto those shares and reinvested the dividends. By the time she passed away in 2010, her investment had grown to a staggering $7 million. Then there's Ronald Reed. He was a gas station attendant and janitor who lived frugally and invested in dividend-paying stocks. When he passed away in 2014, he left an estate worth $8 million. His secret? He consistently invested in well-known companies that paid dividends and held onto those stocks for decades. And let's not forget about Anne Scheiber. She started investing with $5,000 in the late 1940s. She focused on dividend-paying stocks and held onto them, allowing compounding to work its magic. When she passed away in 1995, her portfolio had grown to a whopping $22 million. These stories highlight a few key points about dividend investing. First, it's not about getting rich quick. It's about patience and long-term strategy. Second, it's not just for the wealthy. Anyone can start investing in dividend-paying stocks. And finally, it's about the power of compounding. By reinvesting dividends, you can exponentially increase your wealth over time. But remember, while these individuals achieved tremendous success, investing always carries some level of risk. It's important to do your own research and consider seeking advice from a financial advisor. These success stories show that with the right approach and patience, dividend investing can truly transform your financial future. Before we wrap up, let's revisit the key points we've discussed about dividend investing. Dividend investing, as you may recall, is a strategy that focuses on buying stocks of companies that regularly pay dividends. These dividends are a portion of the company's earnings distributed to shareholders, providing a steady stream of income in addition to any potential capital gains from the stock's price increase. Remember, the process of dividend investing involves diligent research and assessment. You'll need to examine a company's dividend yield, payout ratio, and dividend growth rate, among other factors. It's not just about the highest dividend yield, it's about the sustainability and growth of these dividends over time. And the benefits? They're substantial. Dividend investing offers a reliable income stream, which can be especially beneficial in retirement. It's a way to grow your wealth steadily and passively, allowing you to reap the rewards of your investments without having to sell your shares. Plus, it's a strategy that can offer some protection against market volatility, as companies that consistently pay dividends are often more stable and established. We've also shared some inspiring success stories that highlight the transformative power of dividend investing. These narratives underscore the fact that with patience, discipline and strategic planning, it's entirely possible to achieve financial independence through this investment approach. So are you ready to dive into the world of dividend investing? It's time to start researching and investing in dividend-paying stocks. Remember, the journey to financial freedom isn't a sprint, it's a marathon. And with dividend investing, you have a powerful tool at your disposal to help you cross that finish line. Remember, financial freedom is within your reach with dividend investing. Start your journey today and secure your financial future. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to Full Dose for more financial insights. Thank you for joining us on this journey to financial independence.